This is Vlog Void and my friend, username one. Yeah. And we are going we're going to be talking about muzzle flashes on Sony Vegas Pro 10. So first of all, well this first of all we're gonna wanna remove the audio. So we click on the audio, then we press U. What that does is ungroups it. Because if you didn't do that it would delete the video and the audio. So now we've ungrouped it. Now we press delete and it's deleted. When we mute it, it enables us to add our own gun sounds instead of the fake gun sounds that the gun makes. Okay, um, what we want to do is put some muzzle flashes in. So, what you do, like, we, we're we getting them from uh, um, Action Essentials, which is a whole pack of different, you know, you know, like, effects. You can download it, you have to pay, but, you know. Then. So go on. And we're gonna muzzle go flashes. on muzzle flashes. You can also go on explosionfilms.com to download some for free. Yeah. Well, they're not as good as Action Essentials. Yeah. Well, you can just search for them random. So we're gonna do. So there's there's the side ones. You also got you know first person ones if you wanna do like first person shoot or what. So we're just gonna use automatic fire one. That's it. So we're gonna drag it into Sony Vegas. Okay. What we have to do is right click and create a new video track. So then we move this above. Talk louder. See, now it's all black above that, yeah. Um, some of you will just click add. And that can work, but for some files, it will, it will look lighter, like here it's a bit lighter. You see, but instead, what you can do so is right click properties. properties and remember to untick maintain aspect ratio. Because that way, yeah, it matches your video. And then once we did done that, um, no, we, it's not now. Yes, oh, it's here. So we're just gonna move it here. It doesn't have to be exact because it's gonna be going quite fast anyway. So then what you do is you have this, right? You've had you have one of that, but you don't want it to be there, and you don't want it to be that big. Let's just see if we do. Okay, so then you click on this event pan crop, or if you can't see that, maybe the clip's too short. Just right click video event pan crop. And what you're gonna find is this. So make sure you can still see the video itself. Okay, make sure you're at the front keyframe. Click on that. Right. So now we'll take it to the beginning of the clip. So what you have to do then is you have to move it around so you can do that. Yeah. Well, that will do. We'll do that. We'll move it around for you. You see, but you don't want it to be that big. So what you have to do, you move. You can just zoom out. I'm just gonna zoom out. Click. I mean, right click. <laughs> and then to make it smaller, you have to. You see, the box around it, you see, has to be made bigger. But not too. Don't make the muzzle flashes too small. Or it looks quite big. So then, what you do? No, 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 wait, a bit to the left. Yeah. Don't make it right on the. Yeah, but. So this is what we've got so far. Okay. And it's supposed to be realistic, but we're not done yet. Yeah, but just in case you have, like, let's say the model, let's say your thing's moving, right? You can individually key keyframe each one. So you see it moves. You, you just click on every keyframe on the. Uh, Every time it moves, yeah, you just move it a bit more. Like if you may lose the, you know, if you click here per se, you can't edit it. But you're supposed to click on top, top. Then you just move it. Some of you will have actual moving, so that's what I'm telling you. What what when, what you what happens when you lengthen? Oh, what happens when you when you lengthen a video on Sony Vegas? What it does, yeah. And once you've lengthened it to his max, it restarts the clip and makes a new clip. So you see that little dent here where the, the, that is where the new clip begins. So if you want to move it back to the whole clip, you just move it back there. Okay, so what you do, you play, and then you just see. What, so this is what we've got so far. But we still need to manually keyframe it. So that's okay.
actually it's not, you have to move it a bit like there, and then you can turn that, and then you just click here, that's okay, there, there, a bit more, there, that's alright, because now it re, because we lengthened the clip, we have to do, Another lot of keyframing, and yeah. So what we get is this. So maybe what you see, there's a little space, but still the gun's moving. So what you could do, right, is when it stops. You just press when when, when there's the, between that little space. What we're gonna do is press. We're gonna click on the clip where it is. And then we're gonna click X. That what that does is split. And then we're gonna go. So we're gonna play it. Find find the okay. So we're we're gonna keep um, move the front. Move. It's split. Central Z, Control Z, okay, that undoes it, and then X, and then when it starts again, so we're gonna delete this one and what we've done because we split them. So now, what we're gonna do now, this is what we get. I know that I'll come like this is a machine gun. And then there's also another machine gun. I don't know if this is the other. So, so we're gonna decide which one you oh, match the length. Match the length. Now this one. Let's see if match the length. It it does it misses it slightly. Now let's see the other one. Even if it doesn't match the length here, yeah, we're gonna see. We're gonna show you how to do it so that you see this one doesn't, but still, oh. Mickey, which one would you prefer? Well, twenty, what, twenty-one, or five. Twenty-one. Okay. So what you're gonna have to do, you take your audio clip because this is a shotgun. I mean, a gun. Yeah. You don't want it to be like that, and you want it to be a bit longer. So what you can do is press. You, you just zoom in by pressing the up on the, you know. And then, what you have to do is. What I would do is pull that back and then copy and paste it and then. Look, Mickey. Do this, yeah. And then I'm gonna just do that. Oh no, wait. Yeah, what are you saying, Mickey? What you can do is just do this. Look. Just do that. Yeah, and then do copy, paste, paste, and then lengthen it so that you can hit the end of it. Do that. Do that. Yeah, so that it continues into the next one. What's that? Right. Yeah. So now let's just see what, what we get. Thanks for watching.